Hi, I am definitely not a Russian bot. I'm your typical Generation X American. And I became a card carrying libertarian when Donald Trump got elected. And I have walked away from the Democrats forever. I've noticed something really similar about all these walk away videos, which I absolutely love. You people are fantastic. But if you've noticed, a large vast majority of them are fellow Generation Xers like me. And if you're not a Gen Xer, let me explain to you a little bit about Gen X and maybe you'll know my mindset for the rest of this video. Generation X um, was the late 60s to the 70s of kids that were born then. And we were the first generation that our mommies went back to work. We became the latchkey kids. So most of your Gen Xers are pretty tough because we pretty much went from having a mom to raising ourselves. Um, so we've always kind of took the cards the way they were dealt to us, sucked it up and dealt with it because we had to. And so what's going on right now, we don't get. And I'm also speaking on my social circles of people my age, we all talk about kind of what's going on. We all agree on the following. What's with the screaming, the crying, the whining, the marching, the pussy hats? This gender confusion, drop your pants, you'll figure it out. The Tide Pod munching, um, the Second Amendment, condom snorting. Hey, if you don't know what to do with a condom, you think it goes up your nose, ask somebody from Gen X, we can draw you a picture. I want to resist everything. You're a commie. I want socialism. I want Marxism. Blocking traffic? We need to remove statues. And we're going to burn a flag. Kneeling during the anthem? What? You got a problem with the police? Why don't you protest at the police department? Duh. You know, everyone's a racist. Everyone. And Islamophobic. You're a Nazi because you don't think like me. <sighs> Globalism. Yeah. Open borders. Let's just let everybody in. Join the party. We're going to remove ICE. We don't need a border patrol. What's with this fake feminism? Oh, that really kills me. I've worked my ass off in the construction industry. And what's going on right now is not feminism. Just, just saying. Every day is a new hysteria. Hey, dreamers, wake up. The Democrats don't want to help you. If they were going to help you, they would have already done it by now. The only one that wants to help you is the man sitting in that house right now. Wake up, dreamers. The alarm clock's going off. If you want something done, Trump will get it done. Wake up. The liberal media is so outrageous. Ugh. And the fake news. <laughs> wow, some of it is so funny. Like, stormy, stormy, stormy. Russia, Russia, Russia. It's kind of like Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Jan, Jan, Jan. Really? I need a safe space in my college with some Play-Doh and a puppy to pet. What? You're a fascist. Oh, I need reparations. What happened to self-determination? I'm gonna go to college for gender studies 
and I'm gonna come out and make a great living for my family. And what's with this political correctness? Do you know how many Polish jokes have been told to me over the last 52 years? Seriously, I don't give a crap. And what's with this anti-police thing? Yeah, there's a lot of bad cops, but there's a lot of bad waitresses too. Who cares? And you know, there are so, so much more that I can talk about of what these cuckoo people are doing, but we don't have all day. So in closing, I have a message to each generation. Dear Generation Z, we don't get you, okay? We know you're being indoctrinated by these leftists in the schooling system. We know this. I want you to wake up and do your own research and find out what's right for you, not what these people are telling you in school. Do what's right for you politically. Dear millennials, we know for a fact you're being indoctrinated in your colleges. We need you to wake up, wake up. Your country needs you. Think for yourself for a change. Think for yourself, that's why you're in college, to broaden your horizons. Get out of that echo chamber, do some research and wake up. Dear Generation X that are still with the Democrats, are any of you left? I mean, hordes of you are running away because you see what's going on. Leave this cry fest. You're better than this. I know because I'm one of you. Dear yuppie Democrats, this ain't the party you grew up with, son. This is not the party of Kennedy, and you know it. You see it. Walk away. Dear greatest, greatest generation, this is not the party of the working man. This is not the party of the New Deal. These people don't want to do anything for you. They haven't ever. They haven't probably in the last, I'd say, 50 years. I have and always will have the greatest respect for you. And I speak on behalf of all Generation X. If you need help walking away, we got your back. We will help you walk away.